Hi. Hi. Hello. I'm here in the Mattel warehouse where all the magic happens. And I'm feeling very Vanna White right now. <laughs> I want to get in. Oh, my god. Some of the hallmarks that you can tell that she is the first Barbie are the arched eyebrows. She's always reflecting what is happening in society at the time. And now, here you are. Here I am. Here you are, here. <laughs> it's incredibly meaningful for me to have my own Barbie doll for so many reasons. All of our past collaborations mm. with celebrities, ah! all different types of people. There is a Twiggy doll. There is a Maureen McCormick. Ava DuVernay. When I found out Ava had a doll, I said, I remember saying to Paul, my manager, like, I want a Barbie. You put it on your vision board, and I here it is. I spoke it into existence. You put it out into the universe. That's uh, your head from your doll. This is me. <laughs> I see I can, my, I my, the see mouth in here. Yeah. Like... For Barbie, we have all different hair fibers. Oh my god. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, I love this. This is brilliant. <laughs> Not with your hands. It's like sculpting. So yes, this is Nini Tun. She is lead sample maker here at Mattel. And she worked on the look, the outfit for your Laverne Barbie. I'm living. I love the leg. I love it. <laughs> oh, honey, this yeah. is tricky. Okay, now I'm just going to undo that. <laughs> Such expertise here and so much work that went into it. And I just, I really had no idea. I have to look at all the photos. It's like a thousand pictures of you from the front. I hope you had fun. I loved everything. Are you kidding? <laughs> oh, You're good. such an inspiration. I mean, it's so like for me, it's, it was very. I was very nervous because um, it's, it's quite an honor to meet you. Thank you. I You're that. just a wonderful human being, and I just mm. okay. I can. I was crying before, so it's okay. We can cry today. All right. As a kid, I wanted a Barbie doll so badly, and my mother did not allow me to have one. It was painful, and. My therapist said it's never too late to have a happy childhood, so you should go and buy yourself a Barbie and play with her. And so I did. I went out and bought a Barbie doll, and I played with her, and I addressed her. And um, it was a way for me to heal my, my inner child. And then my mother that Christmas sent me a Barbie doll. It was so deeply and beautifully healing. Now, kids, of all gender identities get to dream with a Laverne Cox Barbie, the first transgender <laughs> Barbie.